Why your results might be wrong. Common problems with regression 1. Are your regression results the last word? So in lab, you ran regressions, you got results, uh, you estimated relationships. Does that mean that those relationships are exactly what you estimated? No. If your results support your model, it's possible that there's a different explanation. If your results don't support your model, it's possible that the cause is some misspecification. So either way, if your results look good, you might not be right. And if, if your results don't look good, if you look like you're rejecting your model, you might not really be able to reject your model. In um, the second case, it could be that uh, the measurement, you're not measuring something correctly, or it could be that the functional form is wrong. Good researchers try to knock down their own story to see if their results hold up to scrutiny. So let's say they've come up with a model, they've tested it, and the data supports their model. They're not done. They then have to see, well, could there be something else causing the same results? Healthy skepticism. It's good. If a claim can stand the test of healthy skepticism, it's a very good claim. And if it can't, if, claim, if the claim falls apart upon examination, it's not so great. You probably don't want to make it. All right, <laughs> how to be skeptical. You know how your model is a story about the way things work? Being skeptical is coming up with a different story that is also consistent with your results. It's like a detective show where there are two suspects and each one has a motive and the opportunity to have committed the crime. So you basically have two stories. Um, and the detective, it's the detective's job to figure out which story is true. All right, here's another, here's an example of other stories. Say the father of a 16-year-old finds pot in his son's jacket pocket. One story to explain this phenomenon is that the son acquired the pot with the intent to smoke it. An alternative story offered by the son is that a friend put the pot in the son's pocket. Both of these stories are consistent with the evidence that there was pot in the pocket the father, detective researcher, explores each possibility, perhaps finding more evidence, and then decides which, which of the stories is more likely. And that's um, pretty much what you're going to do. You're going to be the detective. You come up with other stories that explain your results, and you decide how likely it is that your original model was correct. All right, so why your regression and any regression results might be wrong. These are the things I'm going to cover in the next lectures causality and reverse causality, omitted variables, sample selection, measuring the right thing, changes over time, pooling problems, and functional form. So coming up next, uh, I'm going to start on that list.